So yes, guys, welcome back to my channel. This is Mridala Baska, and I'm so happy to see all of you again. It's really hot out here in Bangalore, and I'm really irritated about it. So what did I decide to do? Retail therapy. So with my mobile in my hand, I ended up ordering so many products, you guys. So let me show you. <clears throat> so these are the packages it came in so without wasting any time let's get right to the video so the first brush is something which i looked at and i fell in love with only because of the color so this is the flawless base set for foundation and concealer the real techniques brush kit so it comes with a brush storage uh, which i don't know if i would be using but yes it's got four brushes and there you go, this is the first product and then it's this beauty. I've been waiting to get my hands on this beauty so let me open her up. So there you go, this is the Huda Beauty Rose Gold Palette, the remastered palette so I love the shade on this you guys. I'll do a separate video if you guys want to swatch of each uh, color. Do let me know in the comment section below. Okay, everyone has been talking about this baby. So this is in the shade Amaretti or Amarati, if I'm pronouncing it right, which is 310 G. Focus, focus, focus. Yes. So, yes. So this is what I'm wearing today. And I loved it, you guys. This is really good. It's full coverage. And then is the Real Techniques sponge. So what I wanted to do is I wanted to order the kit which has two sponges and I ended up ordering this which is the Expert Blending Duo which has this silicone sponge and a normal beautiful Real Techniques sponge. So guys, I don't know how far this is going to work because I have been apprehensive about this um, right from the day I started seeing it on Instagram and YouTube. But if it's not of any use, all that I have to do is use it to mix my foundation and put it on my face. And about this beauty, I don't have to talk much. So yes, the next is my favorite. I think I've, you know, gone through so many dabbas of this. This is the MAC Studio Finish Powder Foundation. I'm giving you a swatch of that. So it's a beautifully milled, so soft and buttery, you guys. I love this. This is in the shade NC35. So yes, that's it. And then I have the Goof Proof by Benefit, which is known by everyone. This is in the shade 5. It's got a spoolie on one side and a retractable pencil on the other side so this I was really apprehensive to get because I'm not a person who's into uh, using pencils or pomades to draw my eyebrows I always preferred uh, using powders but this I think is really good I've used this as well uh, today and I really liked it so yes that's the proof proof the time and tested Prep and Prime Max Fixing Spray. I love this spray, you guys. It can be used in so many different ways. I use it before I put on my makeup. I use it as a makeup fixing spray. And in case my eyeshadows don't have enough pigmentation, I spray this on the brush. Use it. You get double the pigmentation. So I love this baby. This is in lavender. It smells really good as well. Yes, I love this. So yes, this is the Nivea Micellar Air Skin Breathe Cleansing Water for the face, eye and lips. So this I have been wanting to test out for a long time. So yes, I got this. I will definitely let you guys know how this is. So then I got the Nykaa Skin Genius in two shades. 
one is the rose beige and another one is natural ivory rose beige is my shade for my face and natural ivory is a shade which is a tad bit lighter than my skin tone so i thought of using this to highlight under the eyes or uh, you know just to set my concealer so that it gives a brightened look so yes let me give you the swatches of that this is also very very softly milled so yes that is rose beige this one out here and just to talk about the packaging this has got like a plastic sheet over it and then it's got a sponge at its base it's got a sponge at its base so you cannot like sort of open it fully it's you know a little inconvenient but if you're using it with a brush then i think this is perfect so let me give you a swatch of that this is this is in the shade natural ivory and this is rose beige yes guys so the next product that i'm coming to is this nika brow on the point micro fine pencil which i also wanted to try out for a long time because we always can't keep it using goof proof I just want another drugstore alternative. So yes, this is in the shade one, which is we can wand or we can wand. So this also has a spoolie on one side and a very nice retractable pencil that you can use. So yes, the next product that I have for you guys is the Ellie Girl Pro Conceal, which is in the shade, shade which is in the shade natural. It's my concealer shade and this is my contour shade which is beautiful bronze. So yes. Oh, I have one more product from uh, the luxury store which I got free for all the MAC products that I got. So this is a lip density lip pencil in the shade Royally Flushed. So this I love because it's not exactly like a lip liner it's a little thicker than that so it's easy for application and it's a uh, the best to use for travels let me give you a quick swatch of that oh this is a color that i love you guys just have a look at that so beautiful isn't it these are the kind of colors that i really love to wear on a day-to-day -day basis and then we have the studio finish oil primer by pack so this i heard was an alternative for the smashbox oil primer so this is a beautiful packaging and um, yes so it comes in a dropper like that and it's a very nice oil kind of a consistency obviously it's a priming oil i have the nika oh my brow eyebrow mascara and this is in the shade serious brown so these are the only shades that were actually available this is like a mascara so it's a little thicker wand so you can use it to sort of set your eyebrows especially when you're using powders you don't sort of get that stay so this is a very nice product for that and then we have two palettes by wet and wild one is the petalette which is e344b which is so beautiful you guys look at the shades in that and also it's it's got that brow bone eyelid transition crease just to guide you it's given on the palette itself so i love these shades look at those shades guys so this is the limited edition hasta la costa baby so look at the colors of that it's so beautiful and so vibrant I love those colors so yes this is one product which I've always loved so this is the pore primer flawless finish primer by pack that's a beautiful primer you guys it's my all-time favorite and next we have the NYX makeup finishing spray in matte so there you go and then I have the Maybelline fit me foundation I got a travel size pack of this. This is in the shade Natural Buff. 
2.30. So yes, that's it. And then I have the Wet n Wild blushes. I've always loved these blushes, you guys. They are so pigmented and they're really, really nice, you know, to just mix up and give you a flush of blush on your cheek. So uh, these are in the shade Princess Decrees and uh, might I buy you a drink? So this, so these are the two shades that I got. And then I think this is my third bottle of mascara so this is the last sensational by maybelline waterproof mascara next we have this beauty which is a glitter let me open that up for you guys in the shade toasty by wet and wild let me give you a quick swatch of that so cute you guys wow so nice look at that isn't it beautiful? Yes. There's another lipstick that I have for you guys, by, which is the Lacme 9 to 5 Primer Plus Matte in the shade Cherry Chick, which is MR4. Let me give you a quick swatch of that. Um, there you go. This is a very bricky, beautiful shade. It looks really pretty. So, yes, so we've come to the end of the Nika haul. So guys, we are not done. We have another box to go, which is from HOK Makeup. And I'm really, really, really excited about this box. I got two makeup fixing sprays from Wet n Wild. So one is the matte finish and one is a natural finish setting spray. So both are from the Photo Focus range and I love Wet n Wild because they are cruelty free and it's a really good brand. And then we have the bronzer, Wet n Wild bronzer. So yes, and then I got a couple of brushes from Wet n Wild. So let me show this to you guys. I looked at it and I instantly fell in love. I am a fan of rose gold so this happens to be a very soft dome shaped brush which can be used as a highlighting brush and look at the color of that you guys it's so pretty it is p75 and then i have the other brush which is also from wet n wild which is also rose gold in color which is used for blending your eyes this is P15. Look at that, guys. It's so soft and so nice. Okay. So, yes. And then I have a whole lot of glitters out here. So, I'm going to show that to you one by one. So, this, these two are the limited edition glitter palettes by Wet n Wild. Look at the color, you guys. Do let me know if you want me to make a look using the glitter palettes from wet and white i've got a whole lot of glitters i've fallen in love with using glitters you can see i'm wearing it today now a very pretty shade groupie which i have swatched here for you guys this is the one it's so pretty so nice i have a couple of other shades this is the brass shade this is the spiked shade which is like almost a silvery beautiful shade glitters in me we are in love right now so yes next we have the i love revolution rose gold glow i love this packaging you guys look at look at that look at that beauty and then we open it up and uh, we have this shape okay so these are the two beautiful highlighting shades in it so let me just swatch that for you guys and so these are the two highlighting shades you guys so yes guys we come to the end of the Nika haul I really enjoyed showing all these products to you guys and I'm definitely going to use it in all my upcoming videos. Do let me know if you want me to do a look with any of the products out here or you want me to test out any of the products. I will be more than happy to do it for all of you. So 
hope you like the video hit the like button and most importantly subscribe to my videos hit the bell icon and i will see you in my next video bye you guys